Uh, from Brandon Keeling, what do you recommend for student graduated state school wanting to get into investment banking? All right, uh, it's it's a it's a tough one. I, just because you have to understand that all the target schools, essentially the banks come to you. They come to campus and they're here to recruit you and their goal is to get you interested. When you are coming from a state school, no one comes to you. Uh, so what will, you will have to do is you will have to reach out. I mean, one, one of the most common uh, advice you get is hit up the alumni network. Uh, see who is actually in New York. One way to do that, and that's quite a clever way, is if your school has access to Bloomberg, the Bloomberg terminal, you can do a filter and see who actually is from your school, an alumni, who is on the Bloomberg uh, terminal. That will tell you that basically if they have a Bloomberg access on the Bloomberg terminal, that means they're most likely in banking, at least on the trading side. So you'll be able to reach out to them uh, and ask them if they wouldn't mind meeting with you. Uh, again, that's the question of like how to contact alumni. And I think that's, that's definitely the best way to get into it. Um, I've had people reach out to me from my school and I usually always, always answer. Um, otherwise, sending your application will go absolutely nowhere. And I can guarantee you this. Uh, when I would have, when I was at Credit Suisse, we had books of maybe just for an internship position, you had about pre screen CVs, right? That means HR had gone through 9,000 uh, CVs, had tossed about 90% of them and given us 10% of it. That meant we had about 800 CVs uh, split into two big books, uh, and we just looked through them, and you'd have to be extremely lucky as a state school graduate to get into that CV and actually catch my eye. So again, just applying there will not get you the job. You will actually have to reach out to alumni and get contact because you will not get the job just applying with your CV unless you know there's something absolutely incredible that catches somebody's eye, but that is extremely rare. I hope I answered that question, Brendan.